Okay, in this lesson, we are going to the explain the forces. I tell it at the first. These forces are using to all of, of dynamic and simulate system in Cinema 4. It means if you... Sorry about that. Let it delete. If you uh, assign the forces, if you assign the forces to any dynamic, any particle, any cloud system, you don't need to assign them to that. If you put it in a scene, all of the scene effects by um, affected by um, forces. So you can just, as I said before, include them, exclude them from these forces. First forces that I want to explain the attractor is attract something. The attractor, if you insert it, as you can see, it's just infinite dot and you cannot see it. Uh, first lesson, I want to explain how to affect the emitters. Going to the top view, and as you can see, if I play, it's an attractor point and you cannot see anything, just a point. For betting, seeing that, you have to, uh, as you can see, it's an object, it's a, a lot of in, um, simple sitting. But if you want to see it better, you have to go to the field, and I explained them before. Use a, a spray called field. And if you, you have to intersect the particles. As you can see, the particles goes here and it's very small. You cannot see it because it's uh, small and you cannot see. Go to the attractor in an object, make the number and a higher number to better seeing that. Nice. But the problem that I occurred is, as you can see, this is our field in a position and this is an attractor in another position. It's not good. Please select the attractor. No, not the field. Okay. Because uh, you change its position, it's not good. Change, select the attractor, just the attractor, not the children. Not. Because if you select the parent, it's move with its field. Because we want to exactly where is the attractor, it's trying to be there. That's field. So select them and make them move bo both of them. Okay. This is an attractor, make it in here. And as you can see, this field is a fall off. In this circle, we have 100% of the attractor, this power. And in this, from this circle to the circumference of the second circle, we have a fall off from 100% to the zero. Here you can see it's better. This is our uh, particles. And as you can see, it's attracting, but we need a bigger one here to better see that. For changing, going to the start, bigger one, the attractor. Oh, it's a smaller number. Make it a higher number to better see that. This is our particle attracting. And as you can see, the problem occurred here. What is that? The attractive point is here, but we move so accidentally the three called field. It's a bad. Control Z, nice. As you can see, yeah. As you can see, this attractor pivot point is another. Yeah. And now it's correct. When you want to move in, please select the attractor, move it, and then change the size of the, and don't move it again. Select attractor. You see the problem? It's very bad. <clears throat> Nice. And then go make it the higher number for power and play. As you can see, it's attract in this direction and change the direction. It's the attractor. No highs. You can add a lot of attractor. Just uh, don't forget to bring it at the start and you can copy it and use another attractor that you want. So the important thing that you see it's don't, if you want to move your attractor, don't select this recall field because the axis of the attractor has to be exactly the same axis of the, your field. So if you want to move it, select the attractor. Don't forget that. Nice. This is in power. This is an, uh, a speed limit. It's the limitation, it's the damp for your particle. If you see your particle is traveling too quickly, you can damp it here. 
The mood is about acceleration and the force. This mood does not concern, does not affect the, does not work with the effector. It means if you assign going, for example, in this example. Uh, another interesting thing that I want to explain is that you can assign a negative number. It's exactly vice versa of the attractor. See what happened. It's, as you can see, it's push apart the objects in this situation. It's a force that's exactly negative. So you can go in a strings, a, a negative number. Okay. <clears throat> as I said before, the attractor just does not affect the mm, emitter. But it affects a lot of other things. For example, these cloners, this dynamics object like this, okay? Uh, these mm, dynamic objects, okay? We have a collider, rigid body, it's here, it's a tag, oh, so select the cloner, it's here, tag bullet, rigid body, and the collider body. I will explain in the next lesson. But as you can see, they're falling down like this. And I want this scene to beginning, going to the rigid body in a collision and a dynamic set initial. It means if you bring back, it starts from this scene. And now I want to create, you don't need to select anything. You go to the forces, the for the attraction, all of these forces work with the dynamic also. So we need uh, more power like this. The mode, if it's in um, acceleration, it means the um, it calculates the mass of the object. It does not calculate the mass of the objects. Here is a, uh, this is mass. It means the lighter, the light or heavy object does not different between them. It's not a difference between them. It means it calculate the heavy exactly like the light object. But if you select the force, it calculates the mass of the object. So, and the mode object does not work with the particle, just work with the dynamic object. Now see the attractive behavior in these dynamics. Go to the field, a spherical field. I remove the fall off and play it to see. As you can see, it's trying to attract the objects up. As you can see, it's attracting the object. Play with it. It's attracting and shooting the particles. That you can come here. Oh, another ex bad thing that accidentally just select. Yeah, they are exactly the same. Nice. But uh, you can set a negative number here to better seeing that. Nice. Play it. As you can see, it's push apart explode objects you can move them nice this is a negative number of the attractive so worst ways of that is pushing apart the dynamics so imagine how interesting project and work you can do with that that's you uh, have to wait to we make lots of interesting uh idea and example like a MooGraph. and of course uh, I explained it before in uh, Mugger, for example, we use a lot of forces and we create interesting things with that. So this is an attractor. We have an object and we have a field that explained it before. What is the fields? Hello, my friends. To continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.